In the Kawarsan area, we have about a thousand Muslim, uh, and this is the only mosque available for them to pray. We are trying not to uh, jump into conclusions, but uh, you know the timing and uh, the, the fact that it's deliberate and it was just uh, arson. Uh, it's 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 hard to rule out that possibility, and we are. Um, encouraged by the fact that the police also is not ruling out that possibility and they are investigating it as a possible hate crime. This is very difficult for us. Why? Because we congregate five times per day. And you understand this is where we develop spiritual strength. At the end of the day we come and we congregate and this is what gives us strength to move forward. This is taken away from us but we have to live with it and be patient and we hope that uh, you know soon it's going to come back. Islam is a religion of peace. That's what we understand in this community. We have uh, had a very positive relationship with the community. We have open houses uh, to raise awareness for about these issues. And we are hoping even this incident uh, will be uh, uh, one way to, uh, will show that uh, this, is, this type of um, intolerance is not uh, part of Canada or Canadian people. I felt that, you know, these people haven't done anything wrong, so they're trying to make a better life here in Canada, so let's Let's help them out. People are down and they need help, then let's help them. That's what Canada is supposed to be all about. This community, I've lived here for eight years. I've known this community. The people are uh, loving, they're caring. It's just a good community. And uh, this doesn't represent uh, Peterborough. This is just some, you know, isolated incidents. And we have to, uh, this should not change our perception of this community.